بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمدللہ رب العالمین وصل اللہ وسلم علی نبینا محمد وعلا علی وصحبہ وسلم اما بعد احبت فی اللہ اللہ سبحانہ وتعالی سیس کتاب الكریم وسرعینو بی صبر والصلاة اللہ سبحانہ وتعالی سیس and seek assistance or help by being patient and prayerfulness. Ahl Sunnah can learn immense lessons from this exhortion from our Lord Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. And first and foremost that Ahl Sunnah has to be patient, that this is a pillar of the Sunnah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَالْعَسْرِ إِنَّ الْإِنسَانَ لَفِي خُسْرِ إِلَّا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَعَمَلُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ وَتَوَاسُوا بِالْحَقِّ وَتَوَاسُوا بِالصَّرِ By the time, verily mankind is in a loss. إِلَّا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا Except those who believe. وَعَمَلُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ And they do righteous deeds. وَتَوَاسُوا بِالْحَقِّ And they exhort one another to the truth. وَتَوَاسُوا بِالصَّرِ and that they are patient or they exhort one another to patience. Ahabatifillah, this is an immense lesson for us. That understanding that the Hizbiyun, that the various groups and sects will stop at nothing except to humiliate Ahl Sunnah and to belittle Ahl Sunnah to criticize and attack the honor of the du'at of Ahlul Sunnah and the mashayikh and ulama of Ahlul Sunnah. So Ahlul Sunnah must be patient. By following that, that ayah that we mentioned in Surah, Surah Al-Asr, إِلَّا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make his istithna that first Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that everyone is in a loss and then he gives the exception إِلَّا لَذِينَ آمَنُوا except for those who believe أَحَبَتْ تَفِلَّا that belief will only come through ilm it will only come through ilm and Allah raises Ahlul Ilm in different stages and levels so seek knowledge to increase your Iman secondly وَعَمَلُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ and practice that knowledge practice what you understand from Islam, from Islamic knowledge. وَتَوَاسُوا بِالْحَقِّ وَتَوَاسُوا بِالصَّبْرِ And invite people to the minhaj and methodology of Ahlul Sunnah. Call people to Allah Azza wa Jal, to the worship of Allah alone, whether it be Muslim or non-Muslim. Calling the Muslims back to the Sunnah and calling the non-Muslims to Islam in general. وَتَوَاسُوا بِالصَّبْرِ Again, there's that characteristic that Ahlul Sunnah must have, and that's patience. Because you'll find often that your brothers and sisters on the same minhaj, the same madhab, taken from the same ulama, will attack your honor. They will attack you. They will differ with you. But it's only the salihin Muslihin from amongst them who will realize the bigger picture and not let Hizbiyah, not let blind following, not let the shaitan come between the brothers and sisters who are striving to be on the Sunnah of Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So, Ahabatifillah understand that all the trials and tribulations that we face are from Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala and from our own deeds and that what is going to distinguish us is by holding on to the sunnah. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil.